We have a pretty speed deal up here. Food, drinks, every one of our needs is being taken care of. Every one. Man, they better stop setting up brand muffins. Hey, you may want to burn this basket. How are the books they gave us? The feminist joke book's a little ham-fisted, but these fairy tales are interesting. In this one, Cinderella tells the prince he's sapping her woman's strength, and she pushes him aside to create a matriarchy with fluid gender roles. Can you believe these cows actually think we're on their side? We love you, boy! Right on, sister! Check out that pig. <laughs> you don't have to talk about them like that. They've been really nice to us. Yeah, and they really believe in this stuff. That is such a load. Every woman down there is just here because they're jealous. Of what? Of the fact that they're not hot enough to be strippers. They act like they're all offended, but really they're just mad about their own giant butts. Believe me, in their heart of hearts, every woman wants to be her. What about mom? We're not talking about moms. We're talking about women. So all women want to be strippers. There are no women in the world who want to be doctors or lawyers or, or anything like that. Cut the act, Malcolm. They can't hear you. Just because they look like dogs doesn't mean they hear like dogs. I'm sleeping on the other side. Come on, I was just being honest. I'm so whipped. Where are the heroes who fight for a cause? Who live by the code of their own moral laws? Who stand up to tyrants and fight the police? Like Gandhi and Martin and Bobby and Rosa? And Malcolm and Dewey and Reese. And Malcolm and Dewey and Reese. Ah. Reese. Reese. Hi. I've been wanting to talk to you. Really? Yeah, sugar. I had to wait for your brothers to go to sleep. You don't want to share me, do you? Everyone's mad at me. Malcolm and Dewey think I'm a jerk. You're not a jerk. You're just little. I think you're cute as a bug. Do you want me to kiss you? Huh? Yes, ma'am. Wow. Damn tootin' wow. So, will you take off your giant top? Do you have a giant dollar? I'll get a whole bunch if you come back again. I'll come back every night if you want. You're so great! The girls at school won't even talk to me. Listen, if they're not willing to talk to you or dance on a pole, they're not really your friends. You don't need them. You have me. I'm perfect. I'm the only woman in the world for you, Reese. You are? Of course. I'm 60 feet tall. My skin is five inches thick. No matter how creepy and insensitive and thoughtless you are, you can't hurt me. That's all I ever wanted. Why aren't all women like you? Well, I'm not real, sugar. Oh, yeah. You just dreamed me up as a super sexy way to face the fact that you're going to live the rest of your life alone. But that's not for sure, is it? And you know the saddest part? You're going to wake up before you can think of anything really good to do with me. Wait, we can't just give up on this. Wait, don't leave me. Don't leave me! Right now, the mother of the protesters is with a police commissioner pleading for her brave boys whose sacrifice continues to inspire so many. Those boys are like dogs. I have to get them on their backs just to reestablish my dominance. Look, this whole protest thing is a lie anyway. They don't believe a word of it.